Hello everyone, it's Johannes Lacroix bringing you another episode of uh, Test Drive Unlimited 2. This is our 14th episode. Uh, I can't help but just glance at our driveway and look at it in awe, because it's an amazing one. Anyway, what am I doing? Um, so I found, like, the objective screen. Uh, this is the screen where you can set a new objective. You can go into a competition. Uh, our new objective is to obtain our A7 license. Um, and that's because last episode we toured a few, a few uh, apartments that we could possibly purchase. Um, yeah, I like this. Um, what we did there, and we also purchased a, a bright red VW Golf. Um, all of these houses are mine because this is all my driveway. I love it. Quite like, uh... Great! You're listening to Hariba Radio, where the music never stops. Hariba Radio. What am I doing? Wrong indicator! On featuring Asheru Insight. It's a pretty interesting intro. Listen to music all the way, this is pretty fun. Oh, I almost got pretty badly violated for hitting a bus there. Alright, well that was close. <sighs> I could have started something bad. Ah, hatchbacks. They are perfect for cornering. I quite like this. VW Golf. This is perfect. This is perfect. <laughs> ah. Or no, or not. I keep on violating the traffic for running into cars. I just passed a Range Rover like a parents. Okay. It's gonna take a while for us to make it. So they don't blame you for for exceeding the speed limit. They just they just fine you what? Fifty bucks for like going over. Increase the volume on the on the on the game because the because the radio's volume is already full blast. If only you could listen so easily. This is really awesome music.
Well, this was like 2011 pop music. I had no idea what 2011 was about. Um, I have a tiny, I have a small snippet of knowledge from 2013 music. 2014, I know about how bad it was. 2015, I'm full. I'm w very well versed in the idea of 2015. Okay, this is Mobile Disco, and it's called It's the Beat. Alright, I hope this one's any good. Get out of my fucking way! Stupid fit panda! I think we should cut the rest of it out because it's going to take a while. And we're back. It looks as though we've made it through and uh, and now Haribo Radio has a commercial break on it. Oh wow, this track looks promising. Alright, so now the boss in the asphalt zone is Tess Renturi and her father. Alright, time to turn off the radio. I think now's about the time we should... Uh, Okay, let's see what cars they have available to us. Oh wow, Ferrari is here. This is awesome. Come on, why is it taking so long to get ready? Well, let's go. And here we are at the famous Marco Luzzini's Asphalt Racing School. Hello, Marco. Marco, Marco Luzzini. The asphalt is, of course, one of the highlights of Solar Crown. This is where all the qualification trials take place. Will our drivers be fit to participate in the asphalt championships on Solar Crown? Cut, cut. Okay, that's all for today. Looks like you really need to rest. Hi. I'm sorry I'm in a rush. Good luck in the trials. We'll meet on the track. All right, Tess. I hope I get I get the chance to kick your ass. This I think this racing school was created by Tatsuya Nuvolari, and uh, it's been passed down. And through each generation, this racing school has been passed down. This is beautiful. Wow! This Ferrari is awesome. 510 bhp, 198 miles an hour, 3.5 seconds. This is a beautiful school. This is probably the most beautiful school I've ever seen. If only my school looked like this. Oh, this, this thing listens to Haribo Radio as well. It's got pictures of Dodge Vipers and Astons. Oh, it's James Bond's Aston from, from Casino Royale. And uh, it's also got a picture of uh, some off-road cars. And they are a huge fan of Dodge Vipers as well. I think this racing school was created by Tazio Nuvolari in the 1930s, and it's been passed down by generation for every uh, Italian, great Italian racing instructor. Like From Giuseppe Farina, and when he died, it was handed down to... Bandini, and when he died, was handed down to um, Merzario. After that, it was handed down to. You know, after New Valari died, it was handed down to Enzo Ferrari. And after Ferrari died in the 1980s, got handed down to this guy, who's been teaching here for 20 years or something. Alright. I'm going to go for uh, A7, A6 asphalt license. I think we'll start with the first. This is the braking and control challenge. This is the very first one. That was a beautiful school. Alpha Mito! Yeah! Well, it is a good hatchback, but not as good as the VW Golf. Alpha Romeo Mito. And it's style to look like one of those. On. I can't operate. Okay, let's see what this guy has to say. Perfect. 
You managed this just fine. Thank you. I hope the others aren't annoying. Alright. Alpha Romeo know how to make cars very well, and they produced Ferrari after marrying the Fugetti. And here we are. This is the hot halfback level. No big deal. It's like the Disneyland parking, parking area. Yeah, I know, Akili Vartsi or Jackie Stewart would have been way smoother than that. Alright. Great job. I'm impressed. Do not say that over and over again, please. You may be an experienced, uh, racing racing instructor, but there's a lot you need to learn about it. This urban course features several types of bands. Let's see how you're doing. Alright, it's now night time. A lot of days have already passed. It's I've got 16 checkpoints, i got to do this in 56 seconds. That's like a checkpoint every 3 seconds. Ah! I came close to hitting the cone there. Oh boy. 10 checkpoints. Already achieved. Indigestion. No ingest. Alright. It looks like I made it. Easily. Alright, don't say I'm impressed. Perfect. You managed this. Good job. Fine. Thank you. It's a good thing you didn't say I'm impressed, because that's going to be the most annoying thing ever. Camaros! Yay! You will be facing a lot of 90 degree corners. This test trains you for those. This guy's a very serious person. But he looks pretty... Alright. Let's see who's got, who's got their favorite car this tomorrow. This is a... Wow, this is really fast. This is faster than anything I've ever driven. Well, of course it would be. Oh, this is the penalty time trial thing. Oh no, no, come on, go, 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 go! Hey, at least it's better than the Mustang. Very. Mustang was terrible. That looks like we're doing pretty well. We're gonna make it. Just fine. 
Thank you. I did brilliantly though. Try to have the perfect speed when entering the bend. Hairpin turns and 180 degree turns have to be taken differently. That's why 180 degree angles are always, always have a use when you learn them in school. You have to know that 180 degree angle turns. Oh, I've got to go around the track all the time. Oh, see a lot. Come on. Oh, well, it doesn't matter. Let's start again. I'm not supposed to hit anything. Alright, I might have I might have wasted all my time doing that. Ugh. It's gonna take a while. This is harder than I thought it was. Gotta make it. I don't, I don't know if I am going to. No. Yes, I did it. Perfect. You managed this just fine. I think I got to be plus on that one because I had to use the reverse gear to get out of a situation. This is overtaking. Keep it up. Keep it up. He just congratulated me for hitting an alpha. That's brilliant. Well, oh, I've overtaken one person. This is a beautiful, beautiful town. If only I had a house to live in. This is amazing. Alright, well that, that seemed to be pretty a piece of cake. One more. Great job. I'm impressed. Thank you.
challenge requires a good overall mastery of driving skills. All right. Oh, this is all. This one is on the wet. Oh. Looks like I just got back to time. Get out of the way, stupid sign! I have no idea what kind of sign it was, but it definitely was not a stop sign. Wow. Was this short? That was very easy. Okay, so A7 championship now available. Right. And A6. You managed this just fine. At least at least this guy wasn't annoying. Alright, um Okay. Think I've obtained my license now. Congratulations, you managed that quite well. You have obtained a license. Now you just need to win the newly accessible championships. Good luck. I couldn't have done it without you. Thank you, Marco. Very few times in which he, I ever speak. I quite like this. Um. This probably was a this was a racing school. After Tatsuya Nivellari retired, he came to Ibiza, uh, constructed this beautiful school, and became a professor here. Um, until he died, this was his residence. Then it was passed down to Enzo Ferrari, and until he died, it became. Uh, and then uh, Marco Luzzini. Uh, learned how to drive here, and then he, he's now become the professor. Ah, one last goodbye to this amazing racing school before we go. Oh, I'm not allowed to exit from here. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, click the like button or the subscribe button, or leave a comment. If, uh, and, uh, we'll see you guys next, next, um, I'll see you guys next time when we do the A7 Championship. See you next time, guys.